Hi Sunshine Sparkle Faces, it's me, Mother Sparkles. So there is some construction upstairs right now and they're like drilling all morning, which is so annoying. I might have to stop this video like halfway or something, but all... Like, what are they doing up there? Like, I don't know what they've been doing for like four hours now, but it's just drilling and drilling and drilling like... Hello, are you building the art up there? Background change. I know there's a lot going on in the background. There's shoes, purses. I just love, love, love. It might be distracting because you guys might be looking at my shoes and not me, so we might have a problem. Probably the only time I will ever film with this kind of setting in the background. I just feel like it's too much, too materialistic. So ever since I got my new bag, which is that one, it has like suede lining, so it's super, super delicate, and I didn't want like, I don't know, I just, I just wanted like a really nice like a makeup pouch to go with the bag and stuff. And so yesterday I got this makeup case which I'm super super excited about. I'm super happy. It's so pretty. Ew. <laughs> it's the Louis Vuitton Damier Ben cosmetic pouch in the size PM which is a smaller one for your purse. Almost kind of resembles like the Alma bag. Uh, it's just so like attractive and I'm like attracted to you. <laughs> As a beauty junkie, I love watching these kind of videos on YouTube because I enjoy makeup and I enjoy others who enjoy makeup. So, oh god, I could sound like a crazy makeup lady right now. But you know what I mean? I just enjoy seeing what people pack in their bags, what they bring with them. It's just, I don't know, I have like a makeup addiction and I just, you know, like to see what others carry. So these are the essentials that I pack with me and I take everywhere I go on a daily basis. So the products that like I reach for, to touch up, or to apply, um, must have in my makeup case. Opens like a mouth, obviously, and that's what you can see. Basically, it's like a dark abyss of like lost makeup objects, and there's just a lot of stuff in here. I always overpack, that's why I try to keep my makeup pouches at a small size. Like, my makeup pouch is full, but it's not like jam-packed where I can't stick my hand in and grab something, like there's still room. But I just, you know, I feel like it talks to me and sometimes it's like, Mommy, please don't put any more makeup inside me. And I'm just like, <laughs> like shoving it in. Um, but yeah, <laughs> there's one little slot back here and then it's just makeup. So let's just go through it right now. I'll start with the pouch first, which is in here. As you can tell, we are super slim Ollie's pack. Alright, okay. This might be too much information. I know you came here for like a makeup video, but I just have to share why I keep these in here. So, I dilate, for those who don't know what it is, basically it's like, like a medical instrument that looks like a dildo and you have to put lube on it to put inside yourself to keep like the vaginal canal open because I had my surgery. And so, um, after I dilate, I go like rinse myself, I shower, and I have to like douche my, my, my vagina and to get the lube out. But, you know, gravity and I can't get everything out. So after I get out of the shower or if I'm walking that day or I'm out and about, like I will leak. Like I will have like vaginal fluids. So gravity just pulls everything out. So I have to have these just in case, you know, I like, yeah. <laughs> Probably the most interesting what's my makeup bag you'll ever watch. But then anyways, I have a hair tie in here too. It's like a nice little black one that I keep just in case, you know, I gotta keep my hair out of my face. So we're done with that slot. That's education for you today. You're welcome. Um, anyways, we're moving on to the compartment. I'm very particular on how I pack this bag because, like I said, it's dome shape. So I have two lipsticks on both sides and then I have a makeup a powder in the middle. So let me just pull them out. Let's pull the biggest one out first, which is my powder that I use to touch up throughout the day if I'm getting oily or if I need the extra coverage or something. Um, it's a Chanel powder that I'm obsessed with. I always use this. It's the matte powder foundation. This would be my holy grail on the go touch up powder. Like I never use this when I'm doing my makeup, but I only carry this when I'm out and about. So Yes, I love it. So with that, I have a small Chanel Kabuki brush that I also keep in this makeup bag um, to touch up. So 
there's that. I pack mainly lipsticks in a makeup bag. I don't know, I just can't leave my house without a lip product on my lips. I just, I feel naked without them. So I always have like different colors, different shades, lip gloss, lip moisturizer. Like I, I need to have a lot of lip products. That's just who I am. And I mainly focus on the lips when I'm out. So I have a lot in here. Let's start off with this Tom Ford lipstick that I love. You guys know it's my secret weapon lipstick. It is called Pussy Cat, and I'm almost out of this lipstick here. I'm obsessed with it, so I have to have this in my makeup pouch. Moving on to the next Chanel lipstick. This is the 426 Coco Rouge in the color Rosy. Rosy, and it's a beautiful, beautiful pink color. It smells like roses, and it's so like moisturizing to the lips. I love it. It's a reformulated lipstick, um, which is more moisturizing, so I love it. Mm. Moving on is the Chanel Lip Balm. This is my second one. I love this. I put this on before I go to sleep, um, on the go, and it's just non-scented and it's very moisturizing for the cold, dry weather that we have here in Vancouver at the moment. So it's really nice to have a lip balm in your makeup bag. Okay, so I'm just gonna get all the Chanel's out of the way because I love, love, love Chanel. Like I'm obsessed. If you know me very well, you know that's all I ever use. I use their foundation, their powder, their mascara, their lip glosses, and just everything. I'm obsessed with Chanel. I think, I don't know, it just works well with my skin. Their primer is so amazing. I swear by it, it will transform your skin. So Chanel is the only brand that actually works really well with me, so I just love it. But the next is the lip gloss that I use a lot. It is the number 46, which is Giggle. It's part of their um, permanent collection. But it's a nice, beautiful, dark, neutral lip color. You can put this above or on top of any other color. It looks, looks really nice and milky. But I really like this. So, yes, here's the lip gloss. So the next lip product is from Jeffree Star, which I'm wearing on my lips right now. This is obviously for touch-up because I'm about to leave my home. But um, I'm gonna have this in your makeup bag. What is a makeup bag without a Jeffree Star lip product? This is Androgyny. Thank you, Jeffree, for making it permanent. Yay! This is my perfume to go travel size rollerball spray. Um, it's the Gucci Guilty. Oh my god, it smells so good. It's just so nice. So always gonna have a little perfume spray spritz in your makeup bag. So I have that. I got it from Sephora and I think it's almost empty, but no, is it? I think it's halfway, but I love it. It smells really nice. What I have here is a eye coal from Lancome. This is their, I guess, gift purchased um, stuff that they give you. So it's really nice to have like a small dandy eyeliner just in case you have an emergency or you just want to go like a day to night look and you want to add some darkness to your waterline, then this would be perfect. So I have that. Um, the next is a Kat Von D liquid lipstick, which is super popular. It is called Lolita. I bought two recently, and I'm just obsessed with it. It's really pretty. Mmm, I love these colors. Oh, another thing that carries me all the time is eyelash glue. Like, I wear falsies every single day, so you just never know when you're gonna have like an emergency and your eyelashes are gonna fall off and you look like a crazy crack lady. So you always gotta carry eyelash glue with you. It's like a must in your makeup case. I have it everywhere, like all over my house, like all over my purses. Um, must have duo dark toned eyelash glue. Like this makeup pouch carries a lot, right? Like I'm not even done now, I can just pull stuff out. I'm stretched. Next thing in my makeup pouch is the YSL Touche Clot. And this is a highlighter pen, highlighter stick. It's basically like three hours extra sleep in a bottle. If I'm going out for like the whole day, you know, I tend to like, you know, get tired looking. So I just kind of like to revitalize my look and kind of put this under my eyes, quick dab and like, you're just like you woke up. I also have the OPI Avoplex cuticle oil, which is really nice for your cuticles, obviously. I don't know, I like love my nails and my hands. I always gotta take care of it. So my nails always gotta look fresh and clean, especially when you're a transgender woman. People tend to stare at your hands a lot more, so. What? Bitch wear, bitch wear. Almost done, just two more things. So I do have a sample size of the Chanel mascara. This is La Volume de Chanel mascara. I have this in the full bottle, which I got 
where I do my makeup at my table. Um, but this is the nice to go travel size and I feel like it lasts me forever. I keep using this and it's not like run out. So I love it. Gotta have mascara just in case. Last but not least is a very, very sad Maxor lip liner, which I have. It's a small one. I've used quite a bit of it. So I have a little bit left, which I just throw in my purse. But that is all that I carry in my makeup pouch. These are the essentials that I carry with me every single day, everywhere I go. Love them, gotta have them with me at all times. They're my babies. But I'm obsessed with this pouch right now. It's just so cute to, you know, pull this out of your bag and be like, oh my god, I gotta touch my makeup. So, I don't know, it's just really cute, so. Yay. But that is all for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed my what's in my makeup pouch video. Uh, share me something that you can't leave your house without. And I will see you guys next time. Bye. Mwah.